And now a check of the weather from Mike Seidel, who's in for Al this morning. Hey, Mike. Hey, good morning, Ann Curry out here finally without a jacket. Spring has arrived, somewhat in the northeast. But we have snow in the west in Denver through the ski resorts. A blizzard warming is up, warning is up for the Front Range. A foot or more, some parts of Kansas, maybe the worst snowstorm in 17 years. Look at the snowfall adding up along with 40 to 45 mile an hour wind gusts. So a blizzard there down south for concern with severe weather. That line of storms has already produced about five tornadoes. That is heading east into the southeast. That's a quick check of your forecast. Now let's check the weather in your neck of the woods. Hey, Mike Seidel was just talking up a little bit faster now, so we have to continue to watch this. We'll continue to monitor it for you as we zoom it out of here a little bit you can see that line of thunderstorms just starting to slide into the state it's going to drop some very heavy rain we'll keep you updated right here and on 11alive.com don't forget for the latest weather throughout the day check the weather channel on cable and online it's weather.com and all right mike thanks a lot well coming up next david after dentistry we're going to talk with the family we take on board Getting away without breaking the bank. No, we're going to talk to Mike Seidel <laughs> of the Weather Channel. You're who's so got the forecast. It's the Percocet. Mike, take it away. <laughs> okay, Al, we're with some sorority girls this morning from Ohio State University. Not spending spring break on the beach, but down here in New York City, volunteering. Montgomery, Alabama, today's pick city. Storms now rolling through the area with wind and rain and thunder and lightning. More storms overnight tonight and tomorrow. It's going to be a stormy weekend down south. Watch the severe weather, a threat of more wind damage. In the northeast, it gets wet. If you want the sunny, warm weather, head out to Southern California as temperatures warm up through the 70s this afternoon and through the weekend. That's a quick check of your weather from coast to coast. Now here's a check of the forecast in your neck of the woods. Good morning, everyone. Some very heavy rain around. Certainly be looking out for these heavy downpours. We'll keep you updated right here all day long. Enjoy today. Next half hour, we're scheduled to hear from the men of Ohio University singing a special Today Show theme. All right, look forward to that. He's teasing you. You're right behind me. All right, we, we can't wait to hear from you. We come back. The brain power of a six-year-old involved in that photo. The firefighter and now the grown woman have met for the very first time. We're going to share their touching reunion. Oh, that oh, is wonderful. Yes, story. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. Okay, let's get a check of the weather, however, right? We've That's right. Where's Mike, Mike down that way. The Weather Channel standing by. Hey, Mike. Hey, and we've got Matt Lauer's alma mater here, the singing men of Ohio University, and they've got their version, as promised, of the Today Show theme. Take it away, guys. Hey. Excellent, the latest news. Guys, you sounded great. Now the latest weather. We've got problems out through the plains today. A blizzard warning up for Denver. Watch out there, maybe a foot of snow. We've got blizzard watches into Texas. And then down south, the issue is rain. We need the rain, but too much of a good thing at one time. Watches and warnings go out as severe weather, a threat continues. Storms now heading through Atlanta. Rain eventually here in New York City later today. A beautiful day tomorrow. And then the West Coast stays dry, sunny, and warm. That's a look at the weather coast to coast. Now let's check that forecast in your neck of the woods. Good morning, everyone. In our neck of the woods, another 15 minutes or so for the warnings in effect for Harrelson and Carroll County. As we zoom this in a little bit, we got some, some very heavy rain, a little bit of lightning associated with it. We saw more lightning back off to the west, but as it's moving eastward, starting to break up just a bit. Look out for that heavy rain. Don't forget to get your latest weather online at weather.com or on cable and the uh, dish at the Weather Channel. Now let's head down to Washington. Willard Scott is here. Willard, we need to send you a pair of Matt Lauer antlers. You look good on them. <laughs> Actually, Mike, I think he hit a John Deere. I'm not sure. <laughs> hey, you're terrific, Mike. You're Thank a beautiful you. man. God bless you. Thank and you, Meredith, Willard. I thought you were just taking off, but you're sick too. The whole crew is sick. That was a sick one. Hey, happy birthday from Smuckers. We love you, Meredith. You're the best. As the jar spins around, we show, oh, it's a little soggy down here, Morris Biederman. And he's from Riverdale, New York, 102, World War C, Pipsy, New York. 100 years old, secret to longevity, a glass of scotch and water daily. More scotch, less water. That's it, that's all. And now back to the hero of the day. Here's Matt. <laughs> We're matching, Willard. Thank you very much. Good to see you, pal. By the way, Sarah Jessica Jackson's birthday Woo! from Kentucky. Got all our fans here. 
When we come back, we're going to talk about some affordable. By the way, I asked earlier in the show, I said, I wonder how long it's going to be, Jenna, before Anne accidentally bumps I me in the arm. Because I always, always make, you know, I'm not going to, well, he, sometimes he says things that I think it, are slightly didn't take long at all. appropriate. And then I get that. <laughs> look at that was a <laughs> And yet, they continue to seat her next to you. Yeah, so what does that say about the people in the control room? And then apparently she got a hot flash right after that and started doing this. And that Lauer, along with Ann Curry, who's oh. here while Meredith's taking some time off, Jenna Wolf is stopping by as well. And coming up, seven reasons why Americans walk around so tired. I mean, it doesn't matter, apparently, how long you spend in bed. If you, if you sleep for eight hours but not soundly, you might as well get six hours but sound sleep. Right. You'll be better off. Anyway, we're going to talk about what is keeping you up, and we'll find what out. What was that person doing I don't know. In bed? It could I be something I, more. The stories like that. No, that's really nice. So, so, so sweet. sweet. Good stuff. All right, Natalie, Somewhere. thank you very much. Let's go to the Weather Channel's Mike Seidel, who is in for Al today. Mike's outside in some weather that's turning a little bad, isn't it, Mike? It is down south, but it's great out here in New York. It's going to be 60 tomorrow. We've got three ladies from up north. Where are you from? Um, originally from the Midwest. And from Lake, what about gosh? In Minnesota. And you were saying hi to your parents. Mom and Pop. Those are three sisters, happy to be in New York on a spring trip. They've been to the Met so far, and they've got other plans. We've got plans this morning for storms down south. Look at that line of storms. A new tornado watch to early afternoon from near Atlanta down to the Gulf Coast. Watch out for wind damage and the potential for tornadoes. We've already had five overnight in parts of Mississippi with some damage and injuries. Meanwhile, the other story is in Denver in the Front Range. Big snowstorm, a blizzard warning. So far this season, Denver's had less snow than Seattle. That's going to end at least a foot in the foothills. The severe weather will continue to threaten the Gulf Coast and Southeast into Friday night and Saturday as it starts to get wet for a little while here in New York and Boston. But as I mentioned, tomorrow will be dry, sunny, and warmer. That's a look at the weather around the country. Now let's check the forecast in your neck of the woods. Oh my gosh. Now let's go back inside to Natalie. He's driving around. Hold tight to the steering wheel. It's going to be coming down all morning. Enjoy today. Gosh, now let's go back inside to Natalie. All right, Mike, thank you. And now on to today's health and seven reasons you may be tired. We all experience restless nights now and then, but sometimes what keeps us tossing and turning may be more serious than we realize. Dr. Rashid. It takes, takes you an hour before you get to eat. Away. You just cut the, the lower, don't right. you? The lower, right? Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. Well, maybe it tastes better. I, I've never tried it. Okay, you'll have to cook for me now. Let's get a check of the weather now the from the Weather Channel. Mike Seidel, who's in for Al this morning. Hey, Mike. Hey, good morning, ladies. A lot going on today on the weather map. First, we'll start you off with today's map. In southeast, we've got storm severe weather now heading through Atlanta. That's going to shut that airport down. Uh, so pack a lunch if you're flying in and out of there. Severe threat will ramp up again later on today. Out west, it's dry, but some wind in Phoenix with blowing dust and rain arrives later today in New York City. Tomorrow, more needed rain southeast, but again, the threat for some hail and wind, maybe a tornado or two. Here in the Northeast, it is going to be gorgeous. New York City up to 60. Enjoy it while it lasts. Meanwhile, if you want the sun again, sunny Southern California out there in beautiful downtown Burbank, temperatures 75 to 80. More showers for the Pacific Northwest. That's a check of the forecast around the country. Now let's take a look at the weather in your neck of the woods. Good morning, everyone. The heavy to moderate rainfall will be with us this morning and then begin to slack off later. Be on the lookout. And that is a check of the weather this half hour, ladies. All right, Mike, Thanks thank you. Coming up next, the peanut sniffing pooch and his <laughs> family right after those. 93% of those.